Hey, what's up, guys? My name, of course, is Rhino Focus, and today I'm kind of giving you guys something. If you're, you know, new to, you're new to Twitch, and you don't have, you know, an audience yet, you don't have anything, <laughs> and you want an audience and you want stuff. Well, I'm kind of giving you guys something like, kind of like slap on the wrist. <laughs> and uh, what that is is I'm giving you guys overlays. Now, if you guys want to use these overlays, there are going to be download links down below. This can be you know easy to obtain and stuff like that now there are a few things that you will need in advance when having these overlays that I will in fact uh, put in the overlays for you to download <laughs> and uh, that is this text right here on the overlays as you can see this is actually Gotham light regular I will put that inside the package whenever you down download the overlay remember all this is completely free so don't complain saying oh this overlay doesn't look good it doesn't look you know the way i want it to and uh stuff like that because you're getting it for free <laughs> but anyways i'm just going to cycle through some of the overlays that you guys want to look through now of course uh i did say you just need the text but you also need photoshop i didn't mean to mention that or i didn't mention that you will need a version of photoshop you can just download a trial version if you don't have it fully and just do all this real fast if you guys want to but uh anyways so whenever you first download the package, what you're going to want to do is definitely, you know, press this. Because <laughs> this, make sure that this is hidden, the white background. Because, you know, some people are probably going to have a problem with that where they're going to say, I have a white background on my OBS. What does this mean? Why, why am I having this? It may be because you didn't press this. <laughs> and uh, if you see the squares in the background, that means it's transparent. That's good. There's no way, you know, there's nothing behind it so that the image can show up behind it. But uh, we're just going to pop this up for now so you guys can see the overlay a little bit better. So, anyways, this is called Simple Gray Top. This is an overlay, you know, that just has some edges around it with some, um, as you can see, some transparent, wise, black, like, coming out of it. And, of course, all these overlays are made by me, so some of them will have the overlay by Rhino Focus on the top or on it somewhere. But this one's very simple. It just shows your re top donator and recent donators. Um, I'm actually thinking about making a one that shows YouTube and Twitch instead of top donator or recent donors. I might do that. <laughs> so if it's, if it's edited by the time this is out, <laughs> that could have been me. And uh, so, yeah, there goes that one. Then there's the bottom one. So this one's just, you know, if you don't like it on the top, you can have it on the bottom. Really easy. Uh, here goes the simple gray box top left. Now, this one's actually a pretty good one. Um, now, if you guys want to edit some of this stuff, you just click the down arrow right over here. Sorry, my friend got online, so kind of get in the way. But you just click this down arrow over here, and you click this box. So this is YouTube name. This is what's right here and shown in the top left. Click the text tool, click on it, highlight, delete, and enter your YouTube name. Mine would be Rhino Focus, so I just put Rhino Focus right there. But uh, yeah, simple, easy. You know, and do that for Twitter too. You just click the text, click Twitter, highlight, delete, make your Twitter name. And that's kind of, you know, the only time I'm ever going to say this during this video. So <laughs> I might say it a little bit more, but that's about the only time. So there you guys go in there. This one, of course, has a top donator, latest donator, you know, stuff like that. And uh, I also have one for the top right. Um, now, this one is a little bit more simple, it just has YouTube and Twitter. And you guys can see it doesn't say made by Rhino Focus or anything like that. This one's just easy. Because um, some people, you know, they start out Twitch or, you know, they just start streaming. They don't have an audience, so they don't have people donating. Or they don't have, you know, a person there like Modar2K just giving them money. And, you know, they just want to put their Twitter in their YouTube name. So that's completely fine by them. You know, they don't have to have the donators slots. And you guys can see the, the difference was just by these. It's just a little bar right there. That's it. But, uh, yeah. So then right. And then we got the webcam. This is the first webcam one. There's two actual webcam ones. Uh, this is the first one. And this one's just Twitter, YouTube. Again, no donators on this one. Just for, you know, keeping it simple. Twitter and YouTube. Now, this is for 16 by 9 cameras. If you do have a camera that is... 4x3, which is square, some of you guys don't know, um, it will not fit in this, so you'll have some space in between, and uh, I might, 
you know, make a 4x3 one too. Again, if it's updated, the video will probably have an annotation. <laughs> but uh, anyways, here's another one. This is the um, simple gray webcam border or bottom. I don't know why they copied it. But uh, anyways, this one's just, you know, almost exactly the same, except for the fact that it's a little bit fatter on the uh, border type and it has it on the top. Now, this one, uh, whether you want it as Twitter or YouTube is your choice. You can actually click the downer right here, and then if you want to make it YouTube, you undo the Twitters by hiding them, Twitter logo and Twitter name, then you unhide YouTube logo and YouTube name, and then you just change the name, you know, stuff like that. And if you guys want, you guys can also do a slideshow of these. You know how Soda Papa has it to where, like, every 10 seconds or so it pops up YouTube and then like every 10 seconds or so it pops up Twitter. If you guys want to do that, you're going to have to, you know, do the Twitter and then do the YouTube. And you're going to have to uncheck mark all of these, get rid of all the little eyeballs <laughs> and just have that Twitter save it as a file, have the YouTube save it as a file and then just save the overlay as this. It's kind of hard to explain. And you want to pop up a up as a slideshow in OBS, and I could probably show you guys that later if I have time. <laughs> but anyways, there goes that. I'm just gonna pop up Twitter right there again, and yeah, pretty simple. So now the next one that we have is a different version of this one right here. Now this one, as you can see, it's the same thing. It's just that the bottom bar is on the top now, and this is kind of the top version of this, the bottom one. <laughs> So if you guys want to use this one, you guys can use it. If you guys want to use this one, you guys can use it. Uh, like I said, they're all free, so don't bitch about it. <laughs> but the only thing that I do, you know, want to tell you guys about this, I've seen so many Twitch streams like this where they don't pay attention to the overlay and the webcam. If you're going to use a webcam, make sure that there's no lines, like, in between the webcam and the border. Now this one's going to be pretty tricky, you're going to have to probably full screen your OBS just to check to see if there's any lines in between your webcam and your border. But uh, it's going to take a bit. <laughs> Make sure you do that, that completely like, I, I don't know why I just hate watching a stream where they have like even a pixel of the overlay to where like their camera's not on it and it just it annoys the shit out of me. But uh, So yeah, if you guys want to download this stuff, it's in the description down below, click the link. And it will be it will redirect you to Media Fire, and you'll be able to download this stuff. Now, um, I told you guys how to, of course, uh, change the YouTube name, change some of the stuff. And uh, what I want to tell you guys also is make sure you have all of these unchecked, and then you have this unchecked, then save this on your computer. Which you guys don't know how to save file, save as PNG, and then save it whatever the hell you want to save it. You know, but uh. Other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.